Let us solve another gate problem on undirected graph. Here is the problem. Let G be a complete undirected graph with 6 vertices. Let G be is labeled the number of distinct cycles of length 4 in G. That means they are asking for number of distinct cycles. The graph is labeled and complete. So number of distinct cycles of length 4 that means using 4 edges the cycles have to be made and the count will be we are having 4 options the number of distinct cycles with length 4. So you see we are having this one with the 6 number of edges we are having this 6, six vertices ok we are having 6 vertices. So out of these 6 vertices if I am to select this particular 4 vertices then the combination will be 6 C4. And if you go on calculating 64, it is nothing but 15. Okay, now the cyclic combination of n objects, if it is in the cyclic combination, it is n minus 1 factorial. So here we are having cyclic combination of 4 objects. So here it will be having 4 minus 1 factorial, that is 3 factorial, and that is 6. But here you see this graph is not directed. So the combination, whether it is coming left or right, that is m material. So, the number of combinations we will be getting here is 6 by 2 is equal to 3. Okay. So, now for a particular set of 4 vertices, this number of cycles we are getting. But this particular set of 4 vertices can be selected in 15 different ways. So, my answer will be going to 15 into 3 and that is 45. I think you are getting this idea. So, 6 C 4 is equal to 15. So, for the combination of n objects arranged in a cyclic order is n minus 1 factorial. Here the value of n is equal to 4. So, that is why it is 6, 3 factorial means 6. But you see here the graph is not directed graph, it is undirected graph. So, its ordering is not important. So, that is why you will be getting 6 by 2 is equal to 3. And now we will be having this 15 number of ways in which, in which 4 vertices can be selected from 6 vertices. So, 15 into 3 is equal to 45. So, I shall be going with option number C. So, in this way such questions can be answered. Thanks for watching this video.